Hey there, welcome back to my channel, TV Chanel here. In today's video, I am going to share with you all an answer to a question that I get often, and that is, how do I know what my purpose in life is? Now, this could go either way. So, most people would say that your purpose in life is strictly dependent upon what God says you should do with your life. I personally no longer believe that. There was a point in time that I did believe that, but I no longer do. So, there isn't like one sole purpose that you have for your life, okay? There, there, it's not just one. Like, for example, my purpose is to teach, um, you know, spiritual principles online. That's just one of them. Uh, my other purpose in life, or another purpose in life for me, is to, uh, I created these journals that are changing lives all over, literally, the world. Because they've been purchased all over the world at this point. Which is amazing, right? Um, my other purpose is to raise my children, you know, to take care of myself. So, there are many purposes that we all have in this one life. So, in addition to you know all of those things um you know I let me put it this way today my purpose may be or in this season my purpose may be to teach online maybe this time next year it shifts and I'm no longer online but I'm teaching in a different way you get what I'm saying but nonetheless I'm still teaching so whatever it is that you are really excited to do, um, something that you would do for free, which I don't recommend, but would you do this for free, right? Sure, but I'm not. You get what I'm saying? So whatever makes you really excited, uh, whatever you really love to do, roll with that, you know? People always want to know, what is my purpose? And the answer, the short answer is your purpose is to serve. The better question is in which capacity am I destined to serve? That is the better question, not what is my purpose, right? Because we have multiple purposes in life, but that one that, you know, everybody is, is seeking out and looking for, um, that is strictly dependent on you and what it is that you really, really enjoy doing um, and what makes you excited to get up every single day. It doesn't have to be what your mama said, you know, you should be doing with your life or what the pastor says or what your teacher says. It really just is up to you. And so many people waste so much time <clears throat> in their lives trying to figure out what their purpose is. And, you know, at the end of the day, you just do whatever it is that you feel like doing. That is it. Something else that I want to point out is that we live this life multiple times. Some of us, a lot of us, we hear reincarnated over and over and over again. Because there is a lesson that we are to learn in life, in our lives, okay? And um, that shit, in addition to figuring out what your purpose is, you should also want to know why am I here? Not what I should be doing for a living or any of that, but why am I here? Why am I here again? You know, why Why have I been reincarnated again, right? Because usually when, when souls get recycled or reincarnated, it's because in a previous lifetime there was something that, a lesson that we did not learn, something we didn't get. And, and for me, I really believe that is um, to be awakened and to 
um, experience true enlightenment, right? When you really figure out what's really going around on around you and, you know, who we are as spirits having a human experience. Like, that's like the deeper. That's what you really should want to know. It's like, why am I here? Um, what is it that I didn't learn the last 50 lifetimes ago that I need to be trying to figure out now? Right? That to me is the best or the better question, right? But let's go back to this whole purpose thing because I know that a lot of you are just going to want me to narrow it down to something very simplistic. At the end of the day, you can decide what it is that you want to do with your life. And know that it's still going to be in perfect alignment, in divine alignment. It's still going to be perfect, right? Because you're you. You just have to tap into your inner self and listen to your intuition and allow it to guide you in the right direction so that you can figure out what your purpose in life is, okay? So many people use the fact that they don't really know what they should be doing with their lives as an excuse not to do. All right? And that is going to keep you stuck right where you are for the rest of your life. You're not going to feel fulfilled. You're not going to be happy. There's nothing that is going to really excite you, right? That is all on you, though. You have to figure that out. It's really not hard. At the end of the day, we all know what it is that we want to do. Even when I was a kid, I knew that I wanted to teach. But I also knew that I didn't want to teach in a classroom. I knew that much. Because I never liked kids. <laughs> Other people kids. I didn't like kids when I was growing up and I was one. So I knew that that wasn't it. This is not it, right? But I knew in my heart of hearts that I wanted to teach. And um, that is exactly what I'm doing. I'm teaching virtually, teaching all of my people. Uh, it's something that I really, really enjoy doing. I am excited to get on camera and share whatever the message is of the day, of the moment. Um, and that makes me happy, okay? So you figure out what that is for you. It could be doing hair, it could be selling real estate, which I also do and love very, very much. Um, it could be cooking, it could be politics, it could be, I mean, it literally can be anything, all right? But you already know what it is. That's the thing. You already know what it is. It's not like you have to go to some outside source to figure it out. You already know what it is. So go within. I always say that. Go within. Um, meditate. Gain some clarity and figure it out. So... Anyway, I hope that this sheds some light on this whole how do I find my purpose thing. Um, as you all can hear my voice, I am sick. I got a cold. <laughs> uh, but anyway, I hope that this really does help you. And I hope it, as I said, shed some light on this particular subject. Thank you all so much for watching. Please go ahead and thumbs up this video. Subscribe if you haven't already. And share it with a friend. I'll see you all next time.